Alright, so we got the triple stance team with blue gill in the back for that ult damage for Tarmiel and that tankiness for Chandler as well. Now, that doesn't help Asterosa at all, but I think it's probably still better than green gill just for that ult damage. That is increasing, technically increasing Tarmiel's attack by 60% when it comes to that ultimate, right? So I think, I think this would be better than... But in Green Gyo, although Green Gyo is also really good. Uh, the resistance is very good, uh, the crit resistance is very good, but you know, for pure Tarmiel damage, that's it. So I'm running the shirtless <laughs> Chandler now, and I like him. I swear, every time I don't run CC food, I face Ludociel. Every time. It's a curse. Well, let's see. It is a curse, I, I'm telling you. Um. He can't seal me. <sighs> so here, here's what we're gonna do, right? We're gonna put up the level two damage reduction. Mhm. Mm I want. I want to start going for Tarmiel's ultimate, right? And then we're gonna put up a uh, Astarosis counter because I want um, Chandler. Should be tanking uh, Merlin because Merlin's the one doing the big heavy damage, right? And you know, the more damage you take, the more damage you do. He's going for Chandler's ultimate. I'll just take it off. Man, having having Tarmir is such good utility. Man, did he go for the ultimate? I don't know if he did. He didn't. Okay. Actually, huh. Ah. I still want to put up a counter just in case. I don't want my I don't want any chance of my uh my Tarmiel dying, so I I'll keep up the uh, the ult. Okay. I mean, I'll keep up the uh, the counter, I mean, I'm sorry. Blue counter. One unfortunate thing though, I can't kill the Merlin, but I can just take off that ultimate gauge and I'll put up Chandler's counter. Really? How? I understand I was lowered by Chandler, but that was very low damage. Even for being lowered, you know what I mean? That was incredibly low damage. That's weird. Like that with blue gill? That's weird. Okay, I kill uh, very easily here. And then I take off the ultimate gauge from Merlin. Uh, if I knew she was so low, I would have gone for the kill. Oh, it's still killed, regardless. We got Ludo's ultimate, but I'm not very worried about it. <laughs> Listen, Ludo's ultimate is fine, but. Very strange that he tanked that ult so well. Like, honestly. Like, I understand Merlin, right? Merlin can't take more than 40%, but Ludo and Chandler barely took damage. That's very weird. Very, very weird. Well, the match is done. Let's move on to the next one. Oh, that shield's gonna take a little while to break. But uh, sorry I haven't been able to put the intro on my videos. Um, for some reason, YouTube is not accepting any videos with intros for me. It just doesn't accept the video. So... I guess I can't. At least for, not for like this week or so. I'm telling you, every time I don't use CC food, I face Lucio. It's it's like clockwork. I can go for a Chandler ult though. He's going for the kill on Chandler, he knows. Yeah, well, of course he had to guess that Chandler was the one I had the extra card for, right? 
I can't go for a Chandler ultimate anymore. He's gonna just kill him. Hmm. He's gonna kill him if I go for it. Guess what get I'll guess I have to take it slower. Slowly. Hmm. Pascal gets the ultimate though. I mean I could just take it off. He doesn't have he doesn't have taunt. I'm fine. What am I even thinking? If he gets ultimates, I just take it off with Tarmio. Tarmio is my best asset. Yeah, he's just gonna go for it, which makes sense. But, you know. Saw it coming from a mile away. Uh, okay. I'm gonna attack you again. Okay. Waiting for Chandler to attack. It'd be nice actually going for Tormio's ultimate in this turn right here while he can't do anything about it. Like next turn, he's gonna get Asconor's ultimate. But I'll ult with, Tar with uh, Asterosa, so it's, it's gonna be fine. Blue counter. Ooh, that was a good counter. That was, that was a lot of damage. Oh, yeah, she's dead. Okay, okay, now we're talking. So we're gonna go for this. And of course, getting Tarmiel's ultimate. I just put I just put up a stance just so he cleanses the attack lowering, but I don't even have to. He doesn't rely on attack. <laughs> That's fine though. Uh, he can't attack me. So we're just gonna pop in the Asteros ultimate. And it will kill at least Merlin. I don't know about Askan or either. It should, but just in case, I'm going to take off that ultimate gauge. Again, the 60% defense buff. Almost killed. And he quits. Man, Chandler has the best costumes. Of course, same person. I, I'm telling you, it's 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 inevitable. I will face Lucio every time and get my defense lowered. Uh, wait, was my Tarmiel lowered when I ulted? I don't remember. I don't think so. I think it had been already three turns, right? That might have been why. Again, he went for him. Um, hmm. But, I am more than fine. Because I can do this, get my Asteros ultimate. And if he pushes for his ultimate next turn, I would just ult with Asteros and he can do anything about it. Which, look at that! Very, very easy push for Tarmiel's ultimate as well. If I just do this and pop Asteros' ultimate, that's Tarmiel ultimate, guaranteed. He can't take it off, I won. Mm, I mean, his Merlin is still, you know, gonna be alive. But it doesn't really matter because I'm just gonna take off that ultimate. So we're gonna do this and this, boom, Tarmiel's ultimate. And he can't do anything about it, literally can't. If he attacks, he takes off. Uh, he, he takes back my Soros ultimate. My ult of Tarmiel. Take off the ultimate gauge. Hmm. The big question is... Will I kill Ludo? Oh, I'm, de I'm being defense lowered still. That is very unfortunate. I might not kill Ludo. So I'm gonna go for this. Um... Yeah, see, Ludo is really messing me up. That's exactly why I didn't kill last time. Because I was being defense lord. Damn, man. That is just so unlucky that I'm constantly facing Ludusio. Very unlucky. Yeah, I don't have to take off ultimate gauge anymore. That's fantastic. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you very much, game. I appreciate it. That second hit. <sighs> Merlin will not kill me. Of which with damage reduction. She won't. So 
Sorry, she won't be able to get the shield. I gotta take a fault to engage. Wow, that did nothing. What's what's the old level on that Merlin? That did no damage. That did no damage. I need to know the old level of that Merlin. I mean, Chandler lowering the. Is there no one else playing? Like seriously? Like seriously? Is there no one else playing the game? <sighs> Can you not go for Chandler? Your strategy has not been working a single time. Okay, thank you. I was gonna say Chandler, lowering her attack, plus Tarmio having damage reduction definitely contributed though. We're gonna go for this and this. Nurui! She won't do any extra damage with that or seal my healing on Tarmio. Thankfully, um, I'm lowering my defense, doesn't matter for my Chandler. I'll take off that ult with no issues, my guy. Zero. Zero issues. And I'll put another counter up, because why not? Because why not? This will be my last match. And this team that he's using is very bad for me, because he's using, you know, Westerosa and lowering my defense and it still worked so well this team is actually kind of broken just the way you can always have taunt pretty much you can really manipulate where the enemy attacks are going to you can really manipulate the enemy attacks like here like boom and he can't take it off. He physically cannot take off my 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 ultimate. He just can't. I guess I'll play one more just because this person really <laughs> just. <laughs> I'll, I'll wait, okay? I'll, I'll wait like five minutes and then I'll search another another match. Bro, I just played a whole match against an assault melee. Get a record. <laughs> Look at that damage. So, um, I've been having issues not finding bots. If this is a bot, I'm just gonna be content with it, because I'm just getting sick of it. It is. Uh -uh. Yeah. After that part, after that Ludosio guy, I don't, I don't think anyone else is playing. <laughs> I'm, be I'm gonna be honest, like, I I've only faced bots. I guess I'll just be content with a bot. The team is, you know... Um, just getting the uh, the ults basically. Tarmio just hits silly numbers, right? This might not be a bot actually. He went for the Ascanor ultimate? That was pretty smart. I mean, he did attack Astro's attack twice, which is not very smart, but he did go for the ultimate, which is not the worst play ever. I'll, I'll come in that bot for that. I should have put up my stance first. Attack lowered, but it doesn't matter. Regardless, I got my Chandler ultimate. I think this team works much best, and much better if you do have dupes on Chandler. If I'm gonna be honest, uh, it's not necessary per se because Tarmio is doing all the, the silly numbers, right? But you know, Chandler's ultimate is definitely a good complement to the team. Like, yeah, Tarmio is the main meat. Is the main hamburger of the hamburger, while Chandler is the cheese. <laughs> if that makes any sense. <laughs> but you get what I mean. I sealed guys list because I don't want to shield, by the way. The <laughs> the most optimal sealing definitely would be Galfer, but you know me. I can't see her and not seal her. Oop, no shield. And he definitely already has, already has a stun as well, because, uh, you know, a bunch of level 2 cards. So I definitely don't want him to remove my stance either. So I guess it. This, this seems insane. And again, with blue gill, Tormio is just popping off like crazy. 
Furu Kanta. Yeah, that's a, that that summarizes the team pretty well. 